76 point. Yep. Uh, the, the big thing on that one is your tracking speed. Which will be a stat under your actual guns. If you go to show info on your guns, go to attributes, you'll see the tracking speed. I believe it is. Uh, 0 0.01377757 I honestly rads a second. You. I can honestly tell you what a good on, on is average because lock, all, On average lock speed takes anywhere from 5 to 12 seconds. And that all varies on chip size. But, um, yeah, exactly. That tracking speed is very subjective depending on the transversal velocity of your target, which is a column that you can add to your overview, transversal. So the faster guys are going and orbiting at a, uh, very high angles and to related to your ship, they'll have a higher transversal, making it harder for you to, sh to hit them. But there's good opportunities that if they hit off of things, their transversal will go to zero, or like negative almost, a little bit. And if you time a shot on that, you can fucking one shot a frigate with like large fucking like artillery cannons. It's amazing. Mind you, I've I've one shotted lots of frigates because this you go whenever you are. As soon as they hit their own micro warp drive, it's uh, their sig rate's so big that you can generally hit them. Oops. Uh, you're gonna have to make, make me boss because I don't have option to warp the squad. Oh. Actually, you're gonna have to give me about one minute here. MDP. I was in the middle of. Something catching the drip. Big boss. Oh, there it is. There you go. Cool. <clears throat> All right. Well, I need to move myself to. Squad booster. Uh, I've got fleet booster stuff. You have skills. fleet booster stuff. Yeah. Uh, let me oh, check my leadership and I'll tell you. Come in. Oh okay. shit! What I, do? I had to watch this. Okay. Uh, leadership. I've got armored warfare level two, so we'll get four percent bonus to fleet members' armor hit points per skill level. Information warfare two percent bonus to fleet members' targeting range. Uh, siege Warfare, 2% bonus to fleet members' shield capacity. Skirmish Warfare, 2% bonus to fleet members' agility. And those are like all level 2, so... I can't remember. Formation Warfare is 6%. I'm sorry, I can't concentrate with you guys. <coughs> talking about this, I'm gonna I'm just drop down. Are you sure? Okay. Yeah. If you have any questions, let me know, dude. I've got millions of them, but you well, guys are doing your own asking. thing, so... That's fine. Start asking. <laughs> no, it's alright. You guys are doing your own thing for a minute. No, ask. That's ask fine. a question. No. Yeah, we can do this in multitask. It's fine. What you got? Well, I'm being told that um, eventually I, I do need the the other stuff. I I bought the power grid, but I don't need it because I always I was already doing it. Somebody says open up my character sheet and check my skills rather than randomly buying stuff. And then I'm being told that thermodynamics should be trained by the end of your second month, but right now it's not a necessity. So I, I need to know yes, what I should exactly possibly what be buying. Exactly right what now. I said. Thermodynamics isn't a big thing right now. Uh, you can, by all means, uh, cross-reference your skills from your skill cheat sheet to what you have, but you have such a stupid amount of money for skills at the moment that it wasn't a huge deal. I didn't really think of it. You only have 11 skills or something, you said, so it's not a huge thing if you rebuy one by accident. Um, and as for a timeline, you really need a... Well, you have a ballpark plan. We just have to get some skills in your inventory and then we'll be getting EVE HQ downloaded to make a skill plan towards a ship that you actually want to use. We're going to make a fit for your Tristan, and we'll see what you need to train to use the items that we assign to it. There's a process. I just wanted to get you a stockpile of skills. Okay. Um, so I shouldn't buy something I already have? Yeah, no, no. If you want to cross-reference it, it's fine. I, just, I didn't think of it because it's, I don't know, not a lot of money for skills, generally speaking. So if you buy one that's duplicate, it's not a huge thing. Engineering. Hey, Marty. Is that what's Callahan? up? Callahan? What up, buddy? How much? Marty, uh, what's his name? Uh, Pankari's doing a ride-along right now in Sudbury. Oh, is he? Yeah, he should go start some shit and be like... Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Channel switched. Alright, so I don't have advanced weapons upgrade. I'm gonna go ahead and buy this. It's 500,000. I'll buy it. Um, under engineering. That's fine. Uh... Capacitor mission. I don't know what else to get here. I'm, I'm really kind of stuck, guys. Uh, CPU management, I have. Oop, right there. I could train that up, no problem. Capacitor emissions, I don't know what that does for me. Energy pulse weapons. 
130,000. You can probably buy those. Um, electronics upgrades? I guess I need to do something as far as this goes for... Hmm. Power management. I'm doing anything else. We've already got that though, right? Yeah, that's the thing I was told not to worry about. Under engineering. So, I bought it. Why is it not showing up over here, I wonder? Ugh. I'm really just struggling here. Somebody literally just gave me money and I'm, I feel like I'm wasting it at this point. mechanics so I guess I'm good on that armor resistant phasing capital repair ships I was told not to get anything with capital on it <coughs> um, armor layering well shouldn't the stuff that I buy shouldn't that end up over here Inject skills into the head. Okay, so inject skill. I shouldn't go to train now to level one. Okay, now I'm seeing what you were saying earlier. Looks like I bought a couple things that I already have. So let's go ahead and train this up. Oh, you bastard. Well... <laughs> Ain't that a bitch. <clears throat> okay. They call that advanced. Which is why they said I couldn't do it. Inject the skill. Power management. I'm already trained on power. What the fuck. Inject that skill. There we go. See? That's something I didn't have. All of a sudden. Okay. 
cancel that for right now. Energy pulse. Inject. That's a slap in the face right there. <clears throat> they let you buy it, but they don't let you do it until you've got a train. <clears throat> Alright, well. That's okay. That's okay. I should have listened. I'm just so excited. This is hour and 40 minutes into playing this game, and <laughs> I am learning little by little. Look at what my skills are currently, so they don't double my efforts. I have mechanics. I don't need mechanics again. <sighs> um, remote hole repair system. Ten thousand. Not too bad. Price. The only one in station is about ten grand more than. The next guy down. Alright, well, oh. buying it. Um, okay, thermic armor. So I got remote hole repair systems. Station. Let's get that. And the character settings. Click on the cog left filter. Show all skills to show you skills you can purchase. Oh. Oh. Capacitor mission. Under engineering. Skills. I like it. I like it a lot. That's awesome, thanks. Okay. Uh, I meet their requirements for this under capacitor emission systems. Which would probably be under. Oh, the turns. Anything under drones? Drones. Do not, do not, do not, do not, do not, do not. Ah! Drones won! Drones. Okay. Twenty thousand, not too bad, not too bad. Forty thousand, shoot. That's a lot of help there, Bushwalker. I appreciate it, man. Yeah, I got it. I got it. Okay, um what else? Skill trial accounts. Okay, I get it. Alright, so let's go back to drones. It's good. We got that one. Fighter bombers can't do it. Heavy drone operation. I don't need that. So, what I'm looking for is these little check boxes. The only one I fit under the drones is that. Okay. Corporation management. Anchoring. Hull upgrades. Under armor. It's not too bad, I guess. That is bad, actually. 100,000. 